On this video, I'm gonna show you eight different combinations that include the overcut. The first combination is uppercut, hook to the body. The reason why I love this one so much is because it's super realistic. I used to love doing this in fights. Throw that uppercut, get him to raise his hands, and then whack him to the body. Again. Combo number two, we're going to throw the jab, then the right hook, then the uppercut's going to be the lead uppercut, followed by the straight right hand. So when you're throwing this combination, you're throwing that right hook, to get closer to the opponent so you can get with that lead up a good. I throw the jab, I'm coming closer, bringing this shoulder forward with the right hook. Then from there, I'm whipping that right up a cut in, followed by the straight. So we've jabbed, right hook, up, up the middle, and the straight. Now if you think, if I threw the jab, right, the hands have come close, threw that right hook, the hands have come open, and when they're coming open, that's the time to throw that ba -ba, jab, hook, and you can step with that uppercut as well. Jab, hook, ba -ba. right? So really the jab and the hook is just a decoy to get them to open the hands. Again, got me a little mascot here, look at this. Jab, hook, he's opened his hands, ba -ba, through the middle. Ba -ba. This next one, we're gonna throw the lead hook, re-uppercut, lead hook. <laughs> now the idea behind this one is throwing that lead hook for him to open his hands, try and defend in that lead hook by bringing his hand around the side. As soon as he brings that around the side, hit him with that uppercut, then the hook. So I've done the hook, open his hands up, bat, throw that uppercut, then the hands are gonna come close, around the side, bat, bat, bat. And you can get lots of speed in this. If you step with that first hook, you can really get power and speed behind the punch. <laughs> and this one, we're gonna be inside. We're gonna do uppercut first, then the hook, then we're gonna step back, get the distance, throw the two, hook. and then the hook. So I'm inside. <laughs> Now the idea behind this one is we're inside, we're up close. I've hit him with that uppercut and that hook. Now I'm stepping back to create the distance to be able to land the straight two. I went uppercut hook, step back, straight two, hook. Again. <laughs> the idea behind this one is that you're inside, tucked up, back, 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 back. You throw them two fast uppercuts for his hands to come close. As soon as his hands come close to defend them, you're gonna come round the sides. <laughs> Uppercut, uppercut, hook, hook. Love that one. <laughs> this combo, we're going to throw the jab. We're going to slip and step to your left. Come up with that lead uppercut, right hand. <laughs> the idea behind this combination is I threw the jab. He's countering with his right hand. I've slipped that right hand. And as the right, his right hand's coming back, whoop, I've hit him there with the uppercut and straight down the pipe with the two. And when you're stepping, that's helping you get your head off the center line to defend, then come up with that uppercut too. This combination, we're going to jab, then we're going to step to the right, change the angle, come up with the real uppercut, then the lead hook. The idea behind this one, you threw the jab, he's trying to counter with his jab, so you've stepped and you've slipped, you've took your head off that centre line. Then from there, the uppercut, two, as his hands are coming back to his face, whack on the uppercut, two. Now this is my favourite combination of them all, that you use the uppercut in. We're going to lead off with the uppercut, then from there we're going to hook to the head, then whip the hook to the body in. <laughs> Love that one. Now, the reason why this one's my favorite, well, one, I used to use it all the time, and it used to always work, and then two, because you can really land that body shot. So you're touching there with the head, touching, hands come up, whack that body shot in. And the uppercut and the hook don't even have to be hard. You can even touch, touch, whoom, hit that body. As soon as you hit the uppercut and the hook, the hands are coming up, leaving them open for there, boom, again. <laughs> Uppercut hook head, hook body. Love that combo. If you enjoyed this video and enjoy videos like this, please subscribe to this YouTube channel where I upload videos with boxing education, fight breakdowns, everything boxing. So if you enjoyed this, you'll love the rest of the videos in here. And thank you for watching.